Hello ESL students studying Crossroads Cafe. Um, this is the summary of Unit 12, Episode 12, Turning Points. Here we go. Mr. Brashoff has the keys to Crossroads Cafe in his hand, but the door is already open and there is broken glass on the ground. When he walks into the cafe, he is shocked. Everything is a mess. The tables and chairs are on the floor. There are broken glasses, bottles, and dishes. There is graffiti on the walls. Rosa enters the cafe. At first, she doesn't see the mess. Then she tells Mr. Brashoff to call the police. Mr. Brashoff and Rosa go to the back room. There is more vandalism there and Mr. Brashoff finds a knife with Chinese writing. It is in the wall. Rosa says, this is the work of a gang. Mr. Brashoff takes the knife from the wall. He thinks the knife belongs to Henry. He will return it to him. Rosa thinks the knife is a message from the gang. Catherine and Jamal come to work. They are very sad and upset. Mr. Brashoff cannot open the cafe for business. Everyone will work hard to clean the cafe. Police Detective Rizzo comes to the cafe. He agrees with Rosa about the gang. After the detectives leave, Rosa gives the knife to Henry. He is surprised to see it. Henry is at home. His younger brother, Edward, and his mother are arguing about Edward's schoolwork. He is not returning in his work on time. Edward complains about his mother to Henry. Edward is very angry with her. Edward throws darts at a dartboard. Henry throws the knife with Chinese writing at the dartboard. Edward said, hey, where did you get that? Henry doesn't say anything. He just takes the knife and leaves. Crossroads Cafe is closed. Catherine and Mr. Brashoff are working. The door opens. It's Rosa. She's late to work because the bus was late. Catherine has good news for Rosa. Her neighbor has a used car for sale. If Rosa buys the car, she won't have to take the bus. Rosa is not excited by Catherine's news. She is embarrassed. Rosa doesn't know how to drive. She has a learner's permit, but she has no time to practice. Jamal and Jess offer to help Rosa. Henry is talking to Edward at home. Henry asks Ed Edward about the knife. Edward doesn't want to talk. He tries to push Henry out of the way, but Henry throws him to the floor. Edward's shirt rips. Henry sees bruises all over Edward. Finally, Edward talks. Edward is having problems with the gang. They want him to join. When he tries to avoid them, they beat him. Edward had to give money to the gang. He had to steal from the principal at his school. He had to break into Crossroads Cafe. A few days later, a police officer comes to Crossroads Cafe with Edward. The police officer says, we think this punk broke into your restaurant. His brother works here. Everyone is shocked. Then the police officer shows Edward's knife to Mr. Brashoff. Henry has to tell Mr. Brashoff about his brother and the gang. Mr. Brashoff has an idea. Edward and the gang break into Crossroads Cafe again, but this time Mr. Brashoff is there and so are all of the cafe employees, people from the neighborhood and the police. When the police take away the gang, everyone cheers. If you're working on Crossroads Cafe at home and you need help, call your teacher, text her or him, um, email or message. Um, I will put the contact information for 
our offices in the notes. Thank you.